Hello everyone, so today I'm going to show you how to train a deep learning model for road lane detection from scratch. This technology is incredibly important in autonomous vehicles like Tesla and Waymo because it helps them figure out where the lane boundaries are, stay centered in their lanes and drive safely. Understanding how this system works from the ground up is really useful because it lets you recreate this project and even expand it into more advanced applications down the line. So let's start by checking out the dataset. Once you've downloaded it, uh, both the input images and the labels, just copy them into your project folder. If you want a quick preview, there is a file that displays random samples so you can see exactly what the data looks like. Each image shows a driver's perspective of the road and each has a corresponding binary mask. We call it a label wh where a 1 marks the lane and 0 is everything else. Notice that we are focusing on uh, the specific lane the car is currently driving in, which makes it easier for our model to identify and track that one lane as it moves along. Also, if you keep an eye on your terminal while pre previewing this uh, data, you will see important statistics uh, of the dataset, such as the number of images, their shape, their size, and among other information. The model we'll be using is one published by uh, a Michael Virgo, specifically designed for lane detection. It's based on an encoder-decoder setup that's uh, great for pixel-wise tasks. So during the encoding, the model uses convolutional layer with ReLU activation and pooling to compress the image information. This let it pick up on high-level features without unnecessary detail. Then in decoding, it uses upsampling and deconvolution layers to reconstruct that information with pixel-level accuracy, which is exactly what we need to outline lanes. In the end, the model outputs a map that shows how likely each pixel is part of a lane. Next comes the training process. In the train.py file, you will see the code that loads the dataset, splits it into training and validation sets, and then runs the training loop. I've gone for 50 epochs, but you might still get some good results with just 10. It's really up to you. More epochs usually improve accuracy, but it also takes more time. Once the training finishes, we save the model so you can use it later without having to train from scratch. If you want to skip training altogether, just grab the model I already trained straight to testing. So finally, the test.py file shows you how to use the trained model on a real video. All you have to do at this point is load the model, load the video file you'd like to analyze and process it frame by frame. The script will then create a new video with the detected lane overlaid on top of the original footage. In my example, I've got a video with over a thousand frames and it runs pretty quickly, although it might be slower or faster depending on your hardware. You will end up with a clip like this, showing your vehicle's current lane marked in real time. Sure, it might get confused at the intersections or where the lane uh, lines briefly disappear, but once the markings are back, the model snaps right back into action. You'll also notice some minor flickering on dashed lanes, but it does a solid job on clearly painted lines. Hopefully, this video gave you a clear idea of how to build and train a deep learning model for lane detection, how to prepare the dataset, and how to test your model in real-world conditions. 
If you want to try it yourself, you will find all the code and the dataset in the description box. Lane detection is a huge step towards safe and reliable self-driving cars. So I hope you enjoyed exploring how it all came together. Have fun experimenting and thanks for watching.